why free will is important. If you don't believe in free will, you essentially believe that people have no agency and no ability to change. So if you see someone engaging in a bad behavior, it's essentially like they're an automaton or a robot. It's not like you can tell them something and they're going to think it over and maybe they'll still engage in the destructive behavior for a certain amount of time, but eventually they'll change themselves. They'll never change themselves because they have no agency. And if you firmly believe in something, even something that is correct, say like opposing racism, and you think people have no agency, no personal autonomy, then eventually you will come to think that it is justified to use extreme coercive massed force of the state to control people, to change them to be better people. Now, the alternative view is that the free will exists and that liberal, you know, uh, liberty and real liberalism and personal autonomy is important. In that view, you may have people who have views that are destructive, like racism. You may have an Archie Bunker type person. But over time, you know, they will meet a black person and see they are educated and they are making a positive contribution to their family and to society. And they'll change. They'll think it over and they will change their behavior. A society that recognizes that free will and agency is a real thing has to allow the space for people to educate themselves and of their own volition without state coercion coming to the conclusion that they want to be better people. Without this idea that people can change themselves and be better people, you are ultimately going to have a gulag. You're going to say these people are never going to change and they're doing something destructive and terrible. So the only thing we can do to these automatons is round them up and have them break rocks until they die. Determinism, whether it's right wing in like a Nazi racist viewpoint or left wing in a equity and social justice viewpoint, ultimately leads to the gulag because you have no confidence in people's agency and ability to change.